Each year, organ transplants save thousands of lives, and every transplant starts with a donor. Most organ donors are deceased, but some give while they're still alive. Why living donation? Because there are more people who need transplants than there are available organs. Over 100,000 people in the U.S. are on the National Transplant Waiting List. Some wait years to find a match, and around 17 die every day waiting. Healthy people can step in to save them by choosing to donate one kidney or a section of their liver while alive. And because living donors give under optimal conditions, their recipients have even better health outcomes than recipients saved by deceased donors. How do donors live without their organs? Most people have two kidneys, but one is enough to keep a normal, healthy body going strong. And livers are amazing. They regenerate, seriously. When a donor gives part of their liver, the part they keep regrows to its original size in six to eight weeks, and the part they donate grows to full size too. It's the body's remarkable ability to adapt that makes giving while living possible. How do I become a living donor? Anyone interested in becoming a living organ donor must go through lab tests, a physical exam, and a psychological evaluation. This helps make sure their mind and body are healthy and strong enough for a successful donation. After these tests, it's time to check for compatibility. Who gives, who gets? Most living donations are directed, meaning the donor chooses the recipient. Often it's a family member or a friend. There are also non-directed donations, where the donor gives to anyone in need. Either way, the transplant only moves forward once tests prove the donor and recipient are a good match. What can living donors expect? Surgery will be scheduled to take place at a transplant hospital. After the procedure, the donor's recovery time varies. Kidney donors typically spend two to three days in the hospital and return to normal activities in six to 12 weeks. For liver donors, it's around five days in the hospital and eight to 12 weeks of recovery. After that, donors resume life as usual without special limitations or medications. They can enjoy active, healthy lives. Lives made happier with the knowledge that they stepped up to save someone in need. Learn more about living organ donation at organdonor.gov.